no, no. Yeah, don't, don't make pass. rush. That guy doesn't want to do it. <gasps> oh, he did. He did. Wow, all of them, all of them. Hi guys! Hey. Welcome back again to our channel. Today yes. we're watching a new movie that we have not seen, both of oh, us. Oh, we so, didn't. Guys, we're blindly reacting to this new movie. Mm -hmm. This is Sicario, released in 2015. Mm -hmm. What is that? What is that? What is happening? What is happening? <laughs> it's an action movie. That's it is? I think it's an action <coughs> Sounds movie. Sounds a little bit of a flavor of mafia style of a movie. No, it's not. Or maybe I'm wrong. It's not. I know Emily Blunt is here and we've seen her in a movie that we enjoyed, The mm -hmm. Edge of Tomorrow. Remember that movie? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. With yeah. Tom Cruise. Mm -hmm. I like her. So I'm excited to see her in this movie. But oh, with, yes. before we jump into the movie, if you're new to our channel and you haven't subscribed, please don't forget to subscribe and also tap the notification. Please do. Let's just jump into it. The world's a character comes from the zealots, from the zealots of Jerusalem. Killers who hunted the Romans who invaded their homeland. Mm. Ah, really? Interesting. In Mexico, Sicario means hitman. Ah. What? Different meaning. Ah, see her? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh! Oh, oh they have hostages? FBI! Whoa! Oh! Oh! What was that guy thinking? Man, I think it's just near miss. Why'd he shoot? There's no one here. Mm -hmm. Why he shoot? No one was here. <gasps> Bodies. In the walls. I think the hostages are there. Are they alive? Wow. He's dead, Martin. I think they're dead. <gasps> Suffocation. <coughs> Man. Like no matter how many times you encounter something like this, it always gets you, Marion. I think they were the hostages. Maybe rival gangs or something. Look Whoa, at those! So many. The house is full of dead bodies. But well, how could they stay in this house, man? I don't know. It was a smelly or something. No, because they covered it, Marion. So the smell stayed there. Maybe there's a stench a little, but I don't know. Freaking life! It's Mexico. It's not like Alaska or something. It's hot there. Is Women. it Mexico or I Arizona? Think so. I th Try to dig. Maybe you'll find more bodies below. Yeah, babe. Maybe a live one. Did he found something? Whoa! Whoa! Are they dead? The ones close to that. Yeah. Goodness. Ah, the. <laughs> oh. She hit her head or something. The risk of this uh, job. job, yeah. DOJ wants advisors that focus on cartels involved in pursuing Mr. Diaz. He'll be part of the team. Do we get an opportunity of the men responsible for today? <laughs> the men who are really responsible for today, yeah. I'll volunteer. Papa, despierta ti. Yeah, yeah, hombre, yeah. Mama, papa, el café huevos. Tenemos prisa, mama. Sí, sí, ya. Is this the bad guy? I'm trying to guess if he is. Looks like a normal family. Oh, he's like a police? I think so. Good morning. Morning, am I late? Okay. Who is this guy? Have you been to what is before? No, I We're going to El Paso, right? Yeah, I what yeah, the guy is wasted. She doesn't know what's going on. Ah, uh, what if there's gonna be a foul play here? Mexican federal police will meet you at the border and proceed with you to the courthouse located here. All right, we'll gear you up as soon as we're done here. Now, Matt, you can be the tip of the spear and we don't have to rob a guy from Delta. She's like, what is happening? Oh, she's new here. She's nothing than the new member of the team. She only deals with kidnapping, Marianne. Mm -hmm. Not with these cartels and drugs. Hey, I thought you were in prison. They're only dangerous people here, man. Nothing will make sense to your American ears. And you will doubt everything that we do. You will understand. That guy is speaking in riddles. I know. I'm not authorized to follow orders from Alejandro, especially mm. in Mexico. I just want to know what I'm getting into. Okay, yeah, you man. volunteered to get on this train because you, you know you're doing nothing in Phoenix. Do you want to find the guys responsible, yes or no? Yes. This is where we start. It is secret, man. And they use uh, mostly like uh, bad guys as well. 
like they said, it's supposed to be in prison and all that. Because it's a very risky operation, not for the faint of heart. Because I think those men, because they just said that they just came from Afghanistan. So they're like, let's say, Only veterans are here. She's the rookie. Got those bodies, Marianne. The cartel, right? The cartel owns this city, Marianne? Nothing will happen here. If they try anything, it will be at the border. Keep an eye out for the state police. Why? They're not always the good guys. Ah, uh, because they're being paid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By the by the mobs. cartel. Mm. Cartel, yeah. Oh, they got someone. Maybe this is the exchange. Now it's more dangerous because they carry this important guy. Uh huh. And maybe they want to rescue him. Spotter vehicle, left lane. Left lane. Spotter vehicle, 9 o'clock. Ho ho ho. It was a police car. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, it's gone. But they will not know which car it was that guy in. Ah, they separate, Marianne. Yeah. Okay, it's a fuck up. What are we gonna do now? Ah, traffic? Oh no. Car broke down. Uh-huh. On purpose. Yeah, I think so. And this is so tense. Yeah. Everybody's a sus suspect now. Yeah, they're uh. keeping an eye at everyone. Red Impala, two lanes over on my 10. Copy that. Red Impala, two lanes left. Oh no, this is gonna be so messy. This, 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 this yeah, yeah. yeah. Another one? The green silver. Ah, uh, because it's only men, you know? Yeah. Kind of suspicious. Stay in your vehicle. Stay? They do what they do. They get out, you get out. Oh no, so they only can respond to what they're doing. They cannot take the initiative. Oh, why is there freaking traffic? And the dog is a distraction now. The dog can feel it. <laughs> yeah, look at the gun. They have guns? I saw it. No, oh. no, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. They're getting ready too. Maybe they're just waiting who will fire first. Yeah. There are people selling. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait. She said, wait. Move again. It's a never two spot on. No, 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 no. Yeah, Go don't fast. make rush. That guy doesn't want to do it. <laughs> oh, he did. Wow, all of them, all of them. This is not in her. Oh! They're dead. Man, you see what you got into? Ah. This is tense every second. Whoa! Whoa. <gasps> What's that? Good thing she stayed in the car so she yeah. can check the mirror. Got this. Go, 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 go. Ah, the guy's with him. That's it. People uh, are not even uh, amazed. They've seen this every day. <coughs> Who is that guy? Maybe it's that brother they said? The brother of that Diaz? Ooh, I don't want to be a soldier. No. Uh -uh. Good thing here in uh, in uh, Romania, man, it's very hard to get a gun. Uh-huh. Hydrate himself. Hello. Mm, the brother. You don't think we get you here, did you? You know, I brought an old buddy of yours. I bet you I'll blow him. <laughs> the worst I would to say it. <laughs> yeah. I bet you I'll blow him. What's with the water? Torture. I'm gonna step out. <gasps> Did this stop the recording? Yeah. No. Mm -hmm. Zip. Torturing him. You want him to give up his brother? I guess. Let me on a base when you need a ride, don't they? You okay? She's fine. I didn't ask you. Mm -hmm. Oh, he stayed and waited for her. I'm more happy in El Paso. We weren't in El Paso. We were in Mexico. What is this? Ah, they stopped the transportation. The buses, man. See, those are passengers. We want to talk to the people caught around the Nogales area. Okay, they stay and the rest can go. 
Okay, gonna question them. I guess they got some answers from that guy. I don't have any answers for you. Well, let's get some. Do you think you can do better? Yeah. Go ahead. Matt, can you talk for a minute? Matt was the guy's name. I want to know the objective for our walk, period. You go. I didn't ask you to be here. She did. I walked too. Guillermo told us about a tunnel east of Nogales, near Sasaba. Now we're trying to find out what areas near there migrants avoid so we can find the tunnel. We are going to make enough noise that Manuel Diaz is called back to Mexico to see his boss. Ah. His name is Fausto Arcon, El Verdugo. Find them would be like discovering a vaccine. So they're trying to find a tunnel to stop the production of their drugs or to make him, transportation or whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah. To rattle their cages, you know. But on this is big man, bigger. Because they will they have to like um scare that yeah. Diaz so they can get to the bigger boss. Can you imagine? Because here main concern is not the drugs or anything else, it's the people. Yeah. It's just people. The in the look because of the government, man. Well, this is what happens. But they're, they're also scared. It. No, they're not really scared of government, they, but they enjoy the payment. You know, the cartel mm -hmm. is providing. Common people will suffer because of it. Okay, we keep seeing this. Why them? Yeah. Any friends of Phoenix Watt? We are gonna with Manuel Diaz's wallet. This is our Smurf, guys. Blonde hair, white purse. What's a Smurf? There she goes. All right. Go get him, Tiger. Take him. Hey, for real. You're in Get down. Freeze all his accounts, everything. Even if his dog opening the account, I want you to freeze it. <laughs> oh, man. Um, she's handling, like, accounts for Manuel Diaz. You coming? No, don't go in the bank. This is something we can actually build a case on. Don't go in the bank, Kate. They're gonna know you. You think that guy won't check the cameras in this bank? Mm-hmm. And now you're known. A target. Yep. So Manuel Diaz knows that she's involved. Yep. What, a billion? A million. They just seized 17, 17 million. million. A million. Billion. Come on. If we can arrest Manuel for now, we can get him off the street. We gotta get Manuel called back to Mexico. We need to do something now. Can't arrest him. You think it was that easy? Yeah, you need the bigger fish, lady. Manuel, this is not even the, the big fish. I want to follow some semblance of procedure. That's mm. what I want, to build a prosecutable case. Advisors like Matt come in, they stir the pot that cause the criminals to react and make mistakes. These decisions are made far from here by officials elected to office, not appointed to them. I need a drink. Where you want to go? Anywhere. This is deep. Yeah, because she used to follow procedures, you know? They follow, like, book by book. That's what yeah. she does. But now they do it so differently, and that's why it's hard for her to just, like, accept it right away. He was there. Maybe Why? that guy will send someone because they will see her face. <gasps> yeah, that was what I was thinking also. Especially what you said about the cameras. Because for sure that uh, Manuel Diaz has men in America. Working mm. for him. Of course. Ted, man. Long Ted? time, man. How you been? Ted, Phoenix PD. Kate, my partner. How you doing? She's Phoenix PD. Sorry, play. Soft okay. We know this guy. She told me that everything was alright. Ooh. Uh -huh. She needs this badly. <laughs> She's too stressed. <laughs> mm. Game over. Children, go to bed. <laughs> Did you see that band? It's the same band those people wrapped the money, Marianne, or tied the money. It works for the Maybe she will see it. Yeah. Zoom on it. Zoom on it. I zoom know on the it. Color. Zoom on it. There you go, brother. Careful how you react now. Careful. Too much. Sweet one. I just need a second. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes. <laughs> Don't be like, you know, questioning it. Ah, that's it. He knows. Hey, Kate. Oh, shit. Okay. What is it? What? What the? F what the f oh, careful! <laughs> trying not to. I don't know what he's trying to do. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 
<gasps> no. Oh, oh, this guy. He followed Kate, Mario. Yeah, good thing he did. Man, she's Cause not they there. know, but they were like a bit suspicious that <coughs> someone's gonna be following. That guy is good, man. He used me as bait. Now you use yourself as bait. Yeah, exactly. I don't think she's ever gonna dance with a guy in a bar <laughs> ever again. I never wanted anybody to get hurt. I would have never gotten involved in pieces of shit yeah, if I yeah, thought yeah. they were there. Ah, ah. Mom, mom, mom. Oh, don't lie, man. Don't lie. Okay, okay I'm f***ed up, but I'm in over my f***ing head right now. I'm sorry if I... Ah, what the heck? Ah. What was that? Putting the finger in the... Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, ew. Ew. I hate that. Give me all the names of all the Man. But what they if this showing. is yeah but what if this is the main the big fish marian because they, they keep showing this guy to us yeah no it's an old car. he doesn't have a big role now he's just a cop but he can aid them like a normal cop to I do the right thing the, whatever they call him we the will see fish. we will see it's all about creating a diversion. I want the mother of all diversions, boys. We'll hang back when we get there, okay? Then why are we going? Because CIA can't operate within U.S. borders without a domestic agency attached. Oh, that's why they need them. <laughs> See, so they can operate. <laughs> now she's pissed. I said you walk. We walk, maybe beat this whole up operation. No, I have to know. It's too late now. Uh -huh. The product, man. Look at that. Ah! Look at that guy! <coughs> Remember they said they use police um, vehicles to transport it? So yeah. consider him a bandit too. He thinks it's just another day at work. Yeah, you're right. How are we, we have gonna cameras see? and everything. Yeah. It's kind of dark. How are we gonna see them? I mean, it is dark. They got in. Whoa, look at the tunnel they made here, man. How many years, right? I don't think it's wise to take the helmet off. Ooh, they're starting. Oh, that's now. it. They're starting. Fourth of July. <gasps> Hello, they don't know what's going on. Ah, they could hear it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Game over with you, brother. Huh? Uh -huh. Freeze! I mean it. Move away from him right now. <gasps> you shot her. Do you think this guy's joking? Don't ever point a weapon at me again. <laughs> Catch your breath. And get back up there. Man, that guy's deadly, man. <laughs> He took him and left. <laughs> Trying to just understand everything. Whoa. Whoa. Uh, uh, just like that, baby. What happened? They're dangerous, man. They're dangerous, man. He went at the wrong tunnel. He mm -hmm. saw things you shouldn't have seen. He doesn't know about that. About that oh, plan. He's Medellin. Medellin refers to a time when one group controlled every aspect of the drug trade. Providing a measure of order that we could control. And what you saw up there was Alejandro working toward returning that order. What? Alejandro works for the Colombian cartel. I understand. I understand. He works for the competition. They want to be in control of what is happening. They're, what they're trying they're to do. They're not stopping. They yeah, they're not stopping. They're just putting a different um, authority. Yeah, that yeah. That they can have an influence over. Man. So he can get the person that cut off his wife's head and threw his daughter into a vat of acid. What? Also revenge. So this guy, Alejandro, just wants to get to the big boss, right? I guess so, and yeah. Is that the target up ahead, confirmed? Roger that. Black Mercedes. Oh, oh, oh. 
Diaz, no? Manuel Diaz. I guess. He's gonna see you, but no, don't worry, because he's gonna kill that guy. Or maybe, who knows what he's planning. ¿Qué quieres? Mm -hmm. This is Diaz. They shot that guy? Mm-hmm. He's gonna stay right behind him. Now they're going to the big fish. This guy died. Mm -hmm. His son will never see him playing football with him again. Manuel, comprobado. Yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah. Not today. This is just become a one-man job. Mm -hmm. Let's see, this is the the biggest. The jefe. The jefe, yeah. Wow. Can he do it by himself? This dangerous man. I did all of them are going. Uh huh. Dying already. Uh, wow. What They're the... dead. He is a hitman. He is. But with revenge, right? Because he said, like, his wife and daughter, I think. Doesn't. No words, nothing. Kill everything on sight. <gasps> They're having a dinner. With his family. Yeah. This is it. Game over. I'm Provecho. Every night. You have families killed, and yet, here you dine. No fue personal. Para mi sí. But this is personal for you as well. Ahora vas a conocer a Dios. <gasps> they're Kill dead. the family! Yep, they're dead. Wow. Man. So what now? That's it? That's it. With this guy, but... But with the uh, bad things, never gonna be done. Yeah, right? The drug will still flow. Yep. I would recommend not standing on balconies for a while, Kate. Oh, it's him. Yeah, he's gonna <gasps> tell her? He has a gun. What is, what is he gonna tell her anyway? What he did make. Maybe she wants to know. I need you to sign this piece of paper. It basically says that everything we did was done by the book. Uh-huh. She has and no she... choice. If not, she will die, I guess. I can't sign that. Sign it. Nah, it's not the right one. Yeah, she knows it's not. It's not the right way. <sighs> you would be committing suicide, Kate. You think she's gonna sign it? She has no choice. She's afraid. She signed it. She moved to a small town where the rule of law still exists. No. <laughs> That's very comforting. What? Is she gonna shoot him? Yeah, I think so. What can you do if he dies? Yeah. This will still go on. It's not like Nothing changing change. anything. Yeah. this movie i know he is the sicario mm -hmm. this guy oh. Uh... Oh. they're shooting and they're just gonna go back to the game because uh this is not, the, not the head of the chicken the head of the freaking farm sicario uh, is dead like the jefe is dead now. So they want to duel gonna among it. themselves to, to who is going to be the next jefe. For them, it's the same. For the people. For of the me. people, yeah. Sicario. This movie was very interesting. Yeah. I did not expect it. I expected it to, to be like very action. But I like how they made the movie. Mm -hmm. Like the you could see. The yeah. reality. It was more realistic approach. Yeah, it was. Not like uh, impress you in, with the CGI Action style. Moves. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, like, uh, you, you digest it differently, this type of movies. Uh -huh. Like, the more realism it into was, it. It was, it was. Because it's the truth. It is yeah. happening. As, uh, this is what they, I don't know, like, maybe this is what they said. Like, if you are a person in authority, 
authority you have to yeah. make uh, hard decisions and we could see two different two different point of view here mm -hmm. we could see from the girl's point of view and and her partner yeah where they are following by the book right there into this because they really wanted she wanted she volunteered because mm -hmm. she wanted to get rid of that um to, to pe people difference. responsible when they were raiding and they were killing so many innocent people she wanted yeah. to make a difference right yeah to go for the main yeah deal. Right. she that's what she thought that she went into then at the end realizing that they're just gonna put another different um authority a different yeah. dictator let's say i know i know well like she can no man it's just us humans man it's just uh i i i really i really uh, got to the point that the more you get let's say not wiser or smart but the more experience because of the age the older you get and you realize when you look back into your childhood and you think like so simple the childhood right the more you want things in life the more you go for things uh it comes with a risk because the more you want <clears throat> the more to the you're gonna you how, how to call it like if you're not let's say in an educated uh, environment in with a ch uh, some sort of a chance opening uh, ahead of you you're gonna do things that is not really legal they're not really moral they're not whatever and if you're not gonna do it someone else will gonna do it and with that mindset mindset you will take the you know the the wheel and you're gonna be the one doing it no you know what i learned from this movie like there is no morality yeah the morals are gone Oh, like yeah. if you want to keep the peace you have to make war it, it's so yeah and it's so ironic when i saw that guy the big hefe right uh -huh. eating in the with his uh, family and all that like how can you just like stay there and eat and enjoy and be like uh maybe even say a prayer imagine that right uh to really like behave like this like nothing is happening but he has a point when he said like what they say, he said. Like what we are doing, we're, we, who do yeah, you know. think we learned it from? I know they are from governments or people in authority, who, authority be, who is still exactly doing the same thing. Or others before them, yeah. Yeah, or others before them. Like you, when you think about it, this world is the same. Our world right now might be different in in some ways, it's just a twig. But yeah. you know, we're only scratching the surface. What is above us, we don't even know what's going on. I know. Right? We see this president that we have and we vote for him, <laughs> but we know that he is yeah. not the higher authority there. Rick, like, there yeah. is way more that the president has to answer. Like, oh, yes, they, yes. This, for example, that this uh, Kate experienced, like, exactly that. Mm -hmm. like, like, I was uh, reading about these very powerful families in the 1700s when they were, uh, I don't know exactly who they were. Uh, but they were like sponsorship uh, the, the wars and they were giving to nobles and kings mm -hmm. let's say imagine like a billion dollars back then right it wasn't dollars it was in gold and they will get back uh, a lot of influence a, a lot more uh, a lot more like a, a seated uh, important noble seated next to the king uh, lands and way more money on top it's of like it. It's like a game of chess, Moreno. Yeah, it is like a game of chess. And when you think about it, who has to suffer? The common people. Yeah. The the guy they who are. takes his freaking tool on his back, like the whole, ho and goes to the land and works for a piece of bread or rice and comes back home. And that's the only moral person who doesn't go and take anything from someone, but works his land and just try to survive. And you know what? That's the one who is going to be the most punished. Like, imagine, Marion Baldo, you are a police, right? Yeah. You're, you're a little boy and you wanted to be a police to make a difference. And you grow up and you achieve the goal. Yeah. And then you are in the police force already. But you cannot so, do the right thing. I mean, you're still trying to do the right you're thing. Trying, That's what yeah. they call, like, you're a green. Like, you're very yeah, new. Yeah, yeah. You have these morals. And then eventually you experience these things. Like, there are things that you have to break the law in order to to get justice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you kind of question, like, what? where do I draw morality? Where do I Where do I draw the line? I and know. then, come on, that is just below. The, the, you didn't even scratch the and surface the, yet. The more, because you, the more you go in a... Uh, 
in age and you realize everybody else is doing their own thing and getting yeah. corrupted and take money and all that at certain level almost all of them are mm -hmm. you'll be like what the heck am i stupid yeah. do not do the my same my life is too short why i'm <coughs> just gonna do exactly what they're doing because you're gonna doing do it i'm gonna do it you're gonna look at the paycheck and you have like a very bad car and all that and like i said when you want more from life then you're gonna start being corrupt as well and you're gonna get money and you're gonna get a mercedes or a bmw or more for maybe for other people what they did here the um that matt and that uh what's his name alejandro maybe they see it as like it was a bet it was maybe the only better choice yeah and i would say yeah maybe it is the only better choice that they yeah, had at yeah, that yeah, time yeah, yeah, yeah. because maybe they they put another person in charge because the Americans will have an influence on their yeah. decisions, right? Mm -hmm. But they will never ever stop the flow of drug. That we know for sure. I know. Like, because without them, mm -hmm, But right? you really have to go down deeper than this, man. Because it's really... Is it really just about money and wealth and things that you we can buy? We don't know. Maybe there's I more I think I know that. there is more to it. I think because I will tell you that. something. If you go way back in time, like way back, way back, you cannot buy anything. You cannot buy land. You cannot buy... Yeah. There is nothing to buy. Yeah, the money right? did not exist. So what was the most important back then? Like, I'm talking like thousands goods. of years. No, not even goods. Way before there was the human lives. They were so thinking uh -huh. the human lives to be sacrificed for some sort of demonic <laughs> rituals or whatever. So demon. when you when you think about it, <laughs> when you think about it, if you cut down to the... To the whole foundation of this, mm -hmm. the the most reason why they do all of this is to destroy human lives, man. Mm -hmm. It's not about the money. It's not about what they it's can to do. Destroy with the, the good. It's to destroy humanity, man. And also, like I, by corrupting it, in you know, yeah, to, to corrupt more. I was imagining, but Kate, like, cause yeah. she's uh, she's in the FBI and she yeah. was responsible about raid, and then mm -hmm. she experienced these people, like they have yeah. a different job. I was thinking about, like, maybe what if she experienced, uh, she, her job was, you know, like to capture those, let's say, yeah, 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 or those people who kidnap children, yeah, like those, like human traffickers. Wow, that is more. You're gonna she be thought, so she messed thought that up. that she's gonna do, but. She ends up. I'm saying, but what if I'm just in, in a different scenario? I'm thinking. Ah, yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. thinking if yeah. that kind of her job that she's gonna go into, like mm -hmm. those, what I'm saying, those bad people. I bet, I bet there are people in authority. They will not even stop this. They will try oh, yeah, yeah. to stop oh, it. Oh yeah. But it is oh, yeah. all part of a system that we don't even know about. Exactly. Because no matter <clears throat> what, how we much, how much they try to stop. Those guys, those mm -hmm. people responsible, again, you can barely scratch the surface. It's just oh, so yes. deep down oh, there. Yes. And that is what I get from this movie. Yes. But you know what is the saddest thing ever? The most saddest thing ever. Mm -hmm. Everybody knows what is the right thing to do. Yeah. Like every single one. But no one wants to because everybody's doing... But because when you snore a little bit of those drugs, it's just but a glimpse of what they're doing. And you have this like a uh, euphoric uh, feeling in that you are like, I don't know, flying or whatever the heck you're feeling. You feel like everything else doesn't matter because you know why you do that? Not because of the pleasure that gives you, but because you are freaking tormented by the thoughts of the reality that you are in. So you want to live in a dreamland. That's why we're selling so many like, you know, uh, theories and dreams and all that because... If most of the people they don't want to admit we're living in a sad reality in a sad state of you have to survive and you have to wake up and you have to go to work and you have to eat and go to sleep and repeat and they want to do this thing and be like ah oh, life is amazing we do this while doing the bad things you know what i mean i think people are just trying to make the best out of it well, even, best if, out of even that, if they're, even if you're doing it bad, uh, if you even if you're doing bad, really. yeah. Because I was thinking, this is I'm going way deeper now. Don't because, go way too deep. Now. Because Not too much. because this is what tricks me. Like, imagine if you don't do any harm and you just create content for kids, for toddlers. But deep inside, you know that those toddlers they're gonna stay stuck with the tablet in their face, and it's not gonna be good for long term for their brains. 
and you'd be like, so far, he would I would I really care about this because I get some money and I'm not harming really harming anybody like physically, but when you think about it in the long term, you kind of are. But do you care? Well, if you make money, it's uh, you know, it's not that bad as selling drugs to feel bad that some people are gonna you know do something bad with the drugs and all that. But you know what I'm saying, like. Ugh, I don't know what the heck we're doing, man, to be honest. Well, the movie is really good, though. The movie was very good. I like it so Yes, much. very realistic, very... You can, it really shows that nobody is above it, anything. I like it because they're not really showing the gru- gru- gruesome part of the yeah. movie. You, you can tell that they're more focused on the the, the story, I mean, the, the message that they want yeah, to yeah, yeah. put out here in the yeah. movie. And that's what I enjoyed about it. It was good. The tension, especially yeah. at that time when they went to Mexico to Juarez. Uh huh. Yeah. I like that scene. It, it, after every movie, if something really interesting, very interesting to me, I'm searching about. I'm I know about this Juarez, but in the past, like 1900s, mm-hmm. I'm gonna search now, and I'm gonna look into it. What is really happening there as well? Do you know the meaning that they give in the beginning? What there are two meanings of Sicario they give, right? First, uh, Sicario means zealots uh, mm-hmm. in Jerusalem. They're the ones who, they were killers <coughs> who yeah. killed those Romans that yeah. invaded their land, mm-hmm. right? The second one is in Mexico. It means hitman. So yeah. when you combine that, that, this is exactly what this movie is about, right? Man, yeah. So they're trying to get rid of that authority yeah. to put another authority, I guess. <laughs> Oh, it is what it is. Oh my goodness. I hope, yes. guys, I hope you enjoy our reaction to this one. If you have anything else to say about this movie, let us know in the comments. We Please would, do. We would want to hear your opinion about it or anything regarding about this movie. Yes. Or let us know if you enjoy this one. And if you want to see the full version, you can always join us on our Patreon. Please do. Till next time. Bye-bye.